Okay, so here I'm going to show you the easiest way to stack. Down here I've highlighted four images. I click on one and then I shift click to highlight the ones that I want to stack. I am going to go edit in, edit in Adobe Photoshop. Here are my four images right here across the top. I'm just going to look through them and make sure there's nothing that I need to fix. I try my absolute hardest down here to not get too much of the tracked foreground into this image because then I have to black it out or a lot of times make adjustments for stacking. So, first image highlighted here, I'm going to go File, Scripts, Load Files into a Stack, add Open Files, Make sure they're all here. If you've made any changes inside of Photoshop, you will have to save the document and it'll have an edit after it. I'm going to click to automatically align them and to create a smart object. This again is the easiest way to stack, so I won't go into anything too technical with it. We will just do a smart object. Hit OK. Wait a few minutes. Maybe a few more minutes. There's my stacked image, but we have not given it a stacking mode yet. She's moving a little slow. checking this. You can tell right here that this is a smart object by this little guy in the corner. Go to layer, smart objects, stack mode, and use mean. This shows me that they've been stacked. And now I just kind of take a look around. Make sure I don't have any stacking errors. Make sure I'm seeing good definition here. Always check the corners. That seems to be the place where if you're going to have a problem, you're going to have a problem at. And everything looks good. 